Hello, I'm just cleaning the table off. Well, actually, I should probably really wipe it off, but today we are having my family over to make lefsa and cookies. Whoa, I just smacked that. That was probably a loud noise. So I'm getting the kitchen all ready for that. And then we will, I'll probably just show a random little, a random little montage of stuff we do because filming is hard when lots of people are here. But my sister stayed over last night. We made the cookie dough. It's in the fridge. We watched a movie called Christmas Twister. And let me tell you, it was not good. And the title sequence, I'll show it right here. I'll show a picture. <laughs> <laughs> No way. They spelled the name of the movie wrong. They literally wrote Chris Dam's Twister. So that doesn't tell you how bad it is. I don't know what will. But I'm going to finish cleaning up and getting this ready. And we will be on our way. By the way, if you don't know what lefse is, it's a Norwegian, I don't know, is it like a treat or a breakfast food? Wow, I'm really good at my heritage. Um, It's like a tortilla kind of but it's made with potatoes so it's it's a norwegian flatbread <laughs> okay i'm like this is the worst explanation ever basically what it looks like a tortilla but it has potatoes in it and you um like roll it out and use the left stick to pick it up you put it on a griddle you cook it and then you put butter and then either cinnamon sugar or brown sugar on it you roll it up and eat it it's really yummy i guess i eat it as like a treat or a breakfast but either way Yummy, yummy in my tummy. We finally put the wreath up. The hook wasn't working, so we just put a little screw in there, and there it is. So cute. Cody, no, you squashed that. I probably no, Cody, that's that if you, it stinks and they'll no, call the rest of them. throw it outside then. He won't like it, but throw it outside. Come on. What the? It, it will stink. Like they reek. I I've killed them once before. And it Let them on. Cody said he's killed them before and it actually does stink. No, I believe you. No, farther away than that, it's going to come back in. He could climb right back in through the bottom of the door.
it's that little, that thing. You have to like switch it on. Yeah. Oh, cute. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, the lighting in here is really bad, but I got these stockings from Etsy. They are from just a little shop, uh, obviously on Etsy, and it looks like they're like hand knit. They're really nice quality, thick, cute, and they came in really good time, and they embroidered our names on it, and I just love them. And they're right under the words that say all the stockings were hung, and it's just really cute. Also, my sister and I just did my nails. Our, well, our nails, while we watched the Try Guys um, Without a Recipe making gingerbread houses. Okay, I'm going to go under here. But, got Santa Belt, Sparkles, Snowflake, Little Gift, and the Candy Canes. Ah, they're so cute. I love them. But I am baking tomorrow, so I do hope that they don't, like, get in the way of baking. It's been a long eventful day and yeah so after I get ready for bed I'm just going to probably we're probably going to finish watching um Santa Claus is coming to town. We started that the other day and let's go to bed and I will pick this back up in the morning. <laughs> Two days ago, I was feeling very ambitious to like bake things. I bought like stuff to make four different things, which in retrospect might have been a lot. Let's start the baking montage. I'm going to start with the fudge just because I feel like that will be the easiest one to start with since it has to stay in the fridge. Hey Google, play Christmas classics on Spotify. Got it. Playing the Spotify playlist called Christmas Classics. All right, cue the, cue the montage. <laughs>
shopping and just I got some presents ready for my coworkers, but now we're laying in bed watching Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer. I don't think I ever officially showed you guys what I made last night, so we're gonna sit on my floor, on my fridge, and I'll show you. So, here are the Oreo balls that I made. Now, I bet you're wondering, mm, they don't look very aesthetic and beautiful because they didn't turn out aesthetic and beautiful, but um, they do taste great and like, they do kind of look cute, but they're not like perfectly smooth all around it because I cannot figure out how people make it look so smooth and beautiful. So if you know the secret, let me know. And then we got two tubs, I'll just show you one, of peppermint white chocolate fudge. I'm sorry, but look how pretty. I'll put all the recipes down below. Amazing. And then here are the mini cheesecakes that we have not tried yet, but they smell amazing. And I did sneak a little taste of the batter stuff before I made it, um, or before I put it in here. There's um, Oreo crust on the bottom that you can't see, but yum. And then these had to stay in the fridge overnight, so these are like the swirly cookies. I'm actually going to bake those tonight, and I hope they turn out good. I have a, I just like feel like I didn't wrap, roll it good enough or something, so let's just hope that that all goes well. But I'll show you those um, after I make them. Okay, these actually turned out so cute. I was worried that they were not going to look good, but... They turned out so cute. Some of them have holes in the middle, but that's okay. Those are the ends. We already ate a couple of the other ends, but they look so good. And they took forever to make, so they're a lot of work. So I'm glad they turned out nicely. And they taste freaking delicious too, but I've always wanted to make these, but I've been intimidated by the uh, amount of work. Well, I'm gonna end off the vlog here. Um, great say. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you would, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any future videos. And I'll see you guys next time.